we can't do the great things we do without the volunteers or without the funding to get the volunteers on the ground. The Red Cross of Greater Kansas City will soon have volunteers on the ground in Florida. When disaster strikes, responding and helping, it's just what they do. We want to make sure our volunteers have information on what the impacts might be, uh, where they might be needed, and we help make sure that our volunteers have the training that they need. Training that requires money, money that comes from your donations, but legit relief efforts often lose money they need to so-called charities that are looking just to pad their pockets. It just takes one or two, you know, bad acts like that to make it difficult for people to trust online donations to organizations moving forward. And so, you know, it, it does have a cause and effect and it, it can backfire. So know exactly who you're giving your money to and where they are spending those dollars. That research can be the difference between helping victims of a disaster or falling victim to a scam. I would be very cautious of any group or organization that stands up just for that particular disaster. That, you know, it may be very legitimate, it may be very valid, but again, do the homework.